Hello everyone, our lesson for today is all about solving inequalities. In solving an inequalities, there is a properties of inequalities that we can follow. It. And we can see the sign that is less than or greater than or less than or equal to or greater than or equal to. When we see an addition property of inequalities, when adding the same real number to each side of an equality preserves the directions of the inequality symbols. And in mul multiplication properties, if we multiply each side's inequality by the same positive real number preserves the directions of the inequality symbols. In this example number one, if given inequality is multiplied each side by the same positive real number and that's the directions of the inequality symbol is not changed. Let's say we have two quantity of x positive 3. We can distribute first. We have 2 times x is 2x. Then 2 times 3 is 6 is less than 4x positive 10 and then when we when we add both sides to isolate the value of x we can we can have to multiply both sides by negative 4 so we have negative 4x cancelled out and this one becomes negative 2x and then we isolate this positive 6. When we isolate the constant term which is positive 6 or positive 10, this positive 6 we isolate this one and then we subtract each side by negative 6. So we have to subtract negative 6, cancel this one and the meaning is negative 2x less than positive 4 this is positive 4 and then we multiply its side by negative 2 and we can see that, that the, the answer is negative 2 therefore we can change the directions of the inequality since x is less than negative 2 we can change the sign here to flip up the sign because it is negative so we have x is greater than negative 2 we can write the set of solution here which is the set of x such that x is greater than negative 2 and this is the answer and let's have an example number 2 which is negative 4 quantity of x negative 5 is greater than or equal to 2x positive 15 see we can distribute first by using the distributive property of multiplication. So we have negative 4 times x is negative 4x times negative times 5 is positive 20. Then copy the uh, sign which is greater or equal to 2x positive 15. And then we subtract both sides by negative 2 from each side. So we cancel out this one. And the remaining is, since this one is negative 6x, positive 20 is greater than or equal to positive 15. And then we isolate again the value of 15 here. So we have a negative 20 here. So we can subtract each side by negative 20. The remaining is, uh, I cancel out this one first and uh, 
or meaning is 6x which is negative and greater than or equal to 15 minus 20 which is negative 5 and then this one divide each side by negative 6 and reverse the inequality symbol we can reverse the inequality symbol since x is less than or equal to cancel out this one and it becomes 5 over 6 this is x is greater than or equal to 5 over 6 and then we can reverse the symbol which is the inequality symbol is x is less than or equal to 5 over 6 and this is the answer and then in the set notation here we can write that the set of x is the set of x such that x is less than or equal to 5 over 6 and this is the answer and then let's have an example number 3 which is negative 4 the quantity of 3x negative 5 greater than 2 quantity of x negative 4 so first we have to use the distributive property of multiplication so negative 4 times 3x is negative 12x and then negative 4 times negative 5 is positive 20 then copy the signs then we distribute also the here we have 2 times x is 2x then 2 times negative 4 is negative 8 and then we multiply we subtract each side by negative 2 from each side of the inequality so we have cancel out this one we have 2x and cancel out 2x and this one we can add so negative 12x plus negative 2x is negative 14 copy 20 and then this one we isolate also the constant term which is positive so we can subtract each side by negative 20 then cancel out this one the remaining is negative 14x greater than since this one is negative so we can add 20 plus 8 is equal to 28 so we have sign since the sign is negative so we can reverse the inequality symbol we can divide both sides first which is negative 14 then with x is since it is negative so we can reverse the 20 divided by 14 is 2 which is positive but we can reverse the sign so this is x is less than 2 notation here which is the set of x such that x is less than 2 and this is the answer and then let's have an example number 4 we have 2x positive 3 is less than 11 so we have to subtract each side of inequality which is negative 3 so cancel out negative 3 the remaining is 2x is less than 11 minus 3 is equal to is equal to 8 so we can divide both sides by uh, 2 so we can sell out 2 and x is less than 4 and we can write in the set notation is the set of x such that x is 
less than 4. And this is the answer. Okay, let's have an example number 5, which is x positive 4 greater than 3x positive 16. And then, we have to subtract each side by negative 3. So, we have to cancel out this negative 3 here. This one. So, cancel out this. The remaining is x. Negative 2x. Positive 4. Since negative 3 minus x is negative 2x. And then, greater than 16. And then, we also subtract each side by negative 4 here in its inequality. So, we have cancel out this negative 4 and positive 4. The remaining is negative 2x greater than 16 minus 4 is equal to, equal to 12. So, we have 12 here. So, we can divide each side by negative 2 in its inequality. So, we have negative 2 here. And then cancel out negative 2 here. The remaining is x. x is less, is greater than negative, negative 6. So 6 is greater than negative 6. If we flip up this, we can reverse the sign of the directions of the inequality symbol. So we have x is less than negative 6. In the set notation here, the set of x such that x is less than negative 6. That's the answer.